Good morning, today is day 16. We're getting up and out the door a little bit earlier because we want to stop at a coffee shop here in New Orleans. Yeah, we uh, spent the night here. Uh, had a warm shower kind of lined up, but then he, his yard flooded with all the rain we had. We were going to camp in his backyard, so ended up getting an Airbnb here uh, in New Orleans. We're going to ride we're on the east side of the Mississippi and we're gonna ride on the east side right along the river. It looks like pretty much all the way to Baton Rouge. Uh, we're going about 70 today to a campsite uh, right on the river, the way it looks so. South of Baton Rouge, we won't make Baton Rouge. No, we'll only, we'll only make it halfway to Baton Rouge. It's, uh, it's kind of sunny now. They're calling for a chance of rain this morning. And then again tonight, so hopefully it doesn't rain too much on us tonight when we're camping. But uh, I think it'll be a decent day the way it looks. Found a nice cafe for breakfast, hoping to get some coffee and beignets along with a breakfast sandwich. found the culprit, a very tiny piece of glass. I have no idea. First glimpse of the Mississippi River. Ship's loading out here. You got a bike trail that kind of runs right along the Mississippi up on the dike today. This row of trees wasn't here. We kind of blocks our view of the river. A ton of barges out here. Big setup over here. I don't know, can't see it through the trees good. These guys are dredging right here. See the big dredge bucket swinging it once in a while. Man, it's a beautiful place to ride on this top of this levee the whole way. Nice path up here. Smooth.
Filling them bars with grain. This time the culprit was a piece of metal. We're biking through a spillway here. Mississippi gets too high, they open these gates and dump water in here and it goes over into Lake Pontchartrain, which is on the other side of us over there. Fortunately, the spillway is not going right now. Otherwise, we've got to do like a six mile detour to get around this if the spillway is open. Sorry for the wind, probably ships out here in the Mississippi right now. Just came across that spillway. Right here is the other side of it. Busy place along the Mississippi here, I'll tell you. Refineries and grain loading facilities and all kinds of stuff. Flat number three for the day. This is Al's bike now. Of course, it happened in the pouring down rain. <laughs> Al's trying to catch up. I'm feeling bad. I feel left out here. <laughs> this flat situation is getting out of hand. I'll tell you, this is a third one for today. Me and Sandy, we thought we were going overboard by bringing seven tubes. Frank bought two. We're done, we patched a couple at the uh, Airbnb the other night. Ones that just had small holes in them. But now we're down to two tubes. A little panicky, because we won't hit a bite shop probably till Baton Rouge tomorrow. So hopefully we can make it that long without having two more flats. I don't know, we'll see. I'll try patching one of those tubes tonight again. I gotta get a couple more. I think I have like four more patches left in a patch kit I brought. but. Never would have guessed on this bike trail like this we'd have three tubes or three flats today. Just picking up nails and pieces of glass and all kinds of stuff. Deja vu. <laughs> Four miles later, here we are. This tire just falls off anymore. At, this, on at this rate, it'll be tomorrow morning before we get to our camping spot tonight. <laughs>